Alright, so that's five thousand five hundred um Jamaican dollars. Alright, per day guys. You get me? And if we should times that by thirty, right? Let's see what we get. Let's times five five by thirty. And see what we get. I wanna know five hundred times thirty. Man, I'm not burning, I'm just not off to make money, people. Sorry. So, <laughs> so what I tell you, for the 30 days, guys, that's 165,000. I won't give up this, because I know that I want it, know that I'm on it, I'll make it, I promise. You don't wanna... Hey, guys, welcome to another video from Forex for Beginners. Uh, my name is Pablo Pips FX, and in this video, guys, I just wanted to provide you with a quick update. Uh, in regards to COTP, um, if you don't know what COTP is, guys, you can go ahead and um, check out some of my videos. I've been providing updates regarding this company. Uh, it's been uh, making substantial profits for me, and I'm just sharing what's been working for me for those persons who are actually interested in making money online as well. All right, now, disclaimer this is not financial advice. I'm simply just sharing what's been working for me. All right, guys. So, investing and trading is always risky, so you should always be careful as to how much you invest or spend with a product or company. All right. So, with that said, guys, let me just go ahead and show you how it's been going for me. Um, as you see, guys, the last video I posted was like three days ago. Um, you can go ahead and check it out. So three weeks ago, I was at nine hundred and thirty dollars, and right now, uh, my account is at nine seventeen. I did make a withdrawal of a hundred and thirty dollars, and I'll show you guys that as well. So, so far so good. This is day twenty nine been with the company and I paid myself on the 28th so if we go to the mine section and um, the withdrawal records alright you can see that I made a withdrawal of 137 um, USDT which is basically 137 US dollars alright and how I did that um, how I did that was just by tapping on this withdrawal button and then you input the amount that you want to withdraw and um, the address and your transaction password and the specified wallet address so if you guys are on my team most of you guys will be probably using um, CoinZoom CoinZoom Pro so I just want to show you guys uh, the withdrawal record you know the withdrawal I made to my account so right now you're seeing that I only have $18 there it was actually um, zero before you know but I did I did try out um, purchasing this crypto that just launched it's called the ApeCoin so I purchased it yesterday um, so that's why I even have a balance in there to begin with um, but if I go to the USD section, you can see a withdrawal here. Um, let's look at the amount received first. Oh, we need to go to the USDT section. So we're going to go to the USDT section first because we want to actually see the amount that was received. All right. So here's the deposit right here of the 136. All right. That was received on the 28th. All right, and that's my withdrawal from COTP. So as you can see, withdrawals are working perfectly fine, and the company is actually paying out for those who were skeptical. Um, so once I did uh, send that to my USDT wallet, guys, uh, what I did was I had to trade it. I had to now sell that USDT for USD. All right, so I had sold at 136 and for 119 apparently 16 16 USD now I believe it was 137 USD that I got 
I'm not too sure about how um, to read these with fees and all that, but in total, I did recall getting 137, and I'll see if I can show you. That's 114. Oh, wait. Yeah. It's all the fees, guys. It's all the fees that um, took it down to this amount. That's why when you're withdrawing crypto, you want to make sure you're withdrawing a substantial amount to always cover the fees. So in total, I ended up sending an amount of $114 to my uh, account. As you can see right here. All right, that is my account added to CoinZoom Pro. And I should be getting that in a couple of days. Right now it is Friday, so the weekend is coming. So I'm expecting that sometime around Monday or Tuesday. And I think I'll post an update uh, in regards to COTP around that time. But um, so far, so good, guys. If we take a look at the compound sheet, uh, my last balance before my withdrawal was 1020 right so I was at the $30 $31 a day um, ROI threshold so I'm making I was making currently at that at that amount but since I did the withdraw I'll go ahead and uh, change that amount right, just to see uh, where the ROI has decreased to so I'm gonna go ahead and how much is in there let's check how much is in there go to transaction hall all right $917 so let's go ahead and put 917 into the compound sheet all right so right now I'm back to the $26 a day ROI so once it gets to back to that thousand dollar mark I should be expecting to be uh, back at that 3132 ROI and just leave this compounding because I have to pay myself um, like every two weeks or so so that is what I'm practicing just to pay myself every two weeks um, just to keep a steady momentum um, with compounding this account safely all right but so far so good guys if you don't have a coin zoom pro account go ahead and sign up for one click the link in the description it will take you to the page where you all you need to do is put in your name and email and it will redirect you to get started you should receive an email from us within a few minutes from then and then you'll be all set guys but so far so good um what else what else what else yeah yeah everything is all good guys like i said if you're not subscribed to the channel go ahead and click that subscribe button and leave a like on this video to be notified of future videos it's your boy pablo pips effects until next time stay safe